Okay, so don't let this morning's mild weather fool you. I'm sure we're in for at least a couple more days of cold winter weather uh, before the south is sunny and hot again for the spring. So you might want to hear Richland County Sheriff Leon Lott's warning. Within the last two weeks, 13 cars have been stolen after homeowners started their cars in their driveways and went back inside their homes to warm their car up before they leave for work. My first reaction was, Thank you, Sheriff, that's good advice. My second thought was, so what if it happened to you and your car, but you saw the theft in progress and you went for your gun? Don't get me wrong, I think your best choice is probably to not leave your car idling in your driveway like the Sheriff says, or go with another option that he presented. Have a remote start installed in your car. I remember though, five years ago in West Columbia when a homeowner faced no charges after he shot and killed an intruder he saw breaking into his truck behind his house. The case is different in the fact that his truck wasn't sitting idle, one of maybe several differences. I posed the question on Facebook and received a wide variety of opinions. The takeaway from most of the comments, it comes down to imminent threat and the law does not view a thief hopping into your idle car in your driveway as an imminent threat.